welcome to royal vibes. Prince Harry is showing signs he is desperately seeking approval from Prince William, as the prospect of a friendly reunion looks unlikely, a royal expert has claimed. But before we get into it, please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't, turn on the notification bell and also consider liking the video. Tensions between the two royals will not be resolved quickly, despite signs that Harry is asking for the approval of the royal family, particularly his older brother. Speaking on Australia's Today show, Daily Mirror royal editor Russell Myers spoke about the ongoing tensions between the two brothers. Today's presenter Karl Stefanovic said, I hadn't realized that it probably came from William's criticism rather than Harry's. They always like to snub people, but really, Harry seeks approval from his brother William, but his brother closes the door on my own eyes during the event at St. Paul's Cathedral. The royal expert added, Harry is desperate I think for his brother's approval, and yet he's stuck in this kind of no man's land. Harry wants to move on with his life with Meghan in California, they've built this new life, everything seems to be going really well with them. They've made a lot of money off of those Netflix and Spotify deals, and yet he Harry still kind of longs for that family, Myers continued. If he's still doing interviews, he's kind of yelling at them from time to time it's a very, very long way back for him, unfortunately at the moment there's more space between them before these guys can get back together. He added, I'm sure everyone would love it. Carl's co-host Alison Langdon added, hopefully time can heal this wound. In January 2020, Harry and Meghan announced via their official Instagram account that they would step down as royals. The decision was made after many months of reflection and internal discussions, the couple said. They said they have decided on a transition beginning this year to carve out a progressive new role within this institution. In the statement, which accompanied a photo of the couple, the Duke and Duchess said they intend to work towards financial independence, but vowed to proceed in the full support of Her Majesty the Queen. UK along with their two children on June the 1st, and reportedly flew home to the US before the anniversary celebrations were complete. On June 3, the couple arrived at St. Paul's Cathedral to attend the national Thanksgiving service. So with that we have come to an end of this episode, thanks a lot for watching. If you haven't subscribed, make sure to do so. Until next time, bye.